Hello, my dear children. How are you all? Hope you all are fine. Today, we will continue the chapter. Chapter 3, Food and Health. Before we move to the next topic, let's see what we learned in the last class. In the last class, we were discussing about the importance of water and trophies. Then we discussed about balanced diet. A diet that contains all the nutrients, water and roughage in the right proportion is called balanced diet. Then we discussed about fruit pyramid also. In this class, we are going to discuss about diseases. The term disease broadly refers to any condition in which the body is not able to function properly. Diseases can be divided mainly into two categories communicable diseases and non-communicable diseases. Now we will see what is communicable diseases. Diseases which are caused by germs and can be passed on from one sick person to a healthy person are called communicable diseases. Some of the communicable diseases are typhoid, common cold and tuberculosis. Nowadays, we are in threat of Corona. Corona is a highly communicable disease. The disease causing germs are so small that they can be seen only with the help of a microscope. Therefore, these germs are also called microorganisms or microbes. Microbes are found everywhere. They grow very rapidly wherever they get warmth, food and air. They can grow even inside the body of a human beings and animals. Now we are going to discuss about the types of microbes. There are four types of microbes. Bacteria, virus, fungus, protozoa. We will start with bacteria. They are microscopic living organism usually one celled that can be found everywhere. They can be dangerous such as they cause infection. Sometimes they are beneficial also. They help in fermentation and decomposition. In class 4 you learned about what are the good things that bacteria will do. They help in decomposing animals and plant waste. Hope you all remember that. There are some diseases caused by bacteria. Cholera, plant, meningitis, tetanus, typhoid, tuberculosis. These are the diseases caused by bacteria. Coming to virus. A virus is a sub-microscopic infectious agent that replicates only inside the living cells of an organism. Viruses can infect all types of life forms from animals and plants to organisms. I told you nowadays Corona is a communicable disease. It is caused by virus. Some other diseases caused by virus are common cold, chicken box, influenza, measles, rabies, AIDS. Coming to protozoa, it is a single celled microscopic animal like amoebas. The diseases caused by protozoa are malaria, dysentery. Coming to the last type of microorganism that is fungi. They are a group of living organisms which are classified in their own kingdom. This means by they are not animals, plants or bacteria. The diseases caused by fungi are athlete food, ringworm infection. Girls, hope you all understood about today's topic. This is time for homework. You have to draw the disease causing microbes from page number 38 in your copy. Thank you. Have a nice day.